Welcome back, everyone. You're doing a double take. I know. <laughs> the Weasley twins have made their fantastic journey right here to the Good Things Utah set. James and Oliver, a.k.a. Fred and George, are here on Good Things Utah. I just have to say, your follow-through is fantastic. <laughs> is spot on. <laughs> Two months ago, I said, you are coming on this set yep. before you go to FanX, and lo and behold. How did you make it happen? <laughs> you you manifested Intimidation. This. That's I, did. I said, yeah. I need a yes. You did, you did, you did. and we you promised were firm we did. About yeah. it. This was back in July. We were talking about Fantastic Friends airing on the CW, yep. our sister station. How's that going, by the way? Yeah, it's going well. Yeah, it's all available online on CW Online, so everyone can access it on there, all, all, the, uh, all the episodes from season one. And yeah, it's just been great listening to people's ideas of where they want to go on their vacations or ideas to even the place where we went to and do that. So it's been, it's been great listening to people talk okay. about it. I love that we got you two today and we have plenty of time to chat. So we have to take it back. <laughs> we have to talk about why you're here because Fan X, which you'll be at tomorrow, but of course talking Harry Potter, the Weasley twins, unbelievable that you are right here on our set. Now you got cast in this movie, in this whole franchise, when you were 14 years old with no prior acting experience. Tell us that story. You just did. No. <laughs> <laughs> you did. They were 14 years old with no prior. It was an open audition and they were cast after what? Six different auditions? That's right, yeah, yeah. See, yeah. we can tell the yeah, story. Yeah. What was that process like? Was that something you wanted? Did you want fame? Did you want to learn the business? What was, what was it at that time? I think at that age you're not aware of what you, you, you know in person, what do you want to be when you grow up? Like I, was, I literally had no idea. And where we were from, it wasn't a thing where people got into the movie business. It just wasn't, wasn't a thing. Um, but we, we heard there were open auditions, so we went for the first audition. And then, yeah, like you said, there was like five other auditions after that. And eventually we got, we got cast. And it just one of those things where it just kept going and, and kept going. And we, we, we did training um, individually as well along the way. So not just learning on the job, but actually learning the craft as well. And you had no idea that that would change the trajectory or I think we I suppose like naively you assume that every film is a huge budget everyone in the world's going to see it and luckily what we were in was um, right. but it kind of just got to dig it bigger and bigger and I remember we were here we actually came to this studio in 2003 four 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 so there was James myself uh, Matt Lewis who played Neville and Devon Murray who played um, Seamus and we were doing some promotional stuff for it then. And that was, I remember the first time being abroad and doing some promotional work for it and thinking, this is crazy. <laughs> Just being discovered. Yeah, pretty much, yeah. yeah and like, now it's like it. old hat now. It's good. I mean, it's, it's got its benefits sometimes, you know. You get, to, uh, you get to have some fun with different places you go to. Um, like our TV show, what's on here now. Okay, Fantastic um, Friends, yeah. you go all over the place. What do you prefer? And I asked you this. Do you like the movie business or do you like reality TV where you're making fun of each other in a swim? Suit. It's a bad view, that, isn't it? Like, I mean, great view. Great view. <laughs> um, no, I'd say, I'd say both. I mean, TV in terms of going to the locations was really, really great, and having the freedom to do what you want to do with it is cool. But also, being on a film set is still special, isn't it? Yeah, they're two different ways of doing it. I think both. Are, I guess it's like you guys as well. When you're when you're working in front of the camera, you're you're fully focused on that. So when we're doing. Uh, the Fantastic Friends episodes, they're like 18 hour days filming and when you're film, when you're doing uh, acting it could be a 12 hour day but you've normally got to learn a lot of lines for that so you're, you're mentally knackered after both, yeah. you're both spent. things. Yeah, they're yeah, different, different things but, but we still were able to be able to have fun doing both again. and we kind of play up to the cameras when we're doing the Fantastic Friends That's what thing I wanted well. to ask you, because you're either playing a character or you are yourself, but it's always like a heightened version of yourself, yeah, isn't it? it's always slightly more exaggerated. I feel like that's kind of what this job is as well. We have some kids who came to <laughs> meet you today, <laughs> and are so if excited. I don't ask a question from them, they'll be very upset. Okay. So we have to ask what your favorite of the Harry Potter movies, what was your very favorite one to film? To oh. film? Um, probably the fourth one. Goblet of Fire. I think one of our kids guessed that. Yeah, yeah. It's, it was because there was new sets obviously what, what came in. There was new cast members who came in like Rob and Stan and, and Clemence and we... Rob, we just said, <clears throat> hold on, Rob. 
This is where so, yeah, yeah. Dina yeah. wants to pause, a long pause on this for a minute. Yes, she's having in. a moment. I just want to take it in. So we, and I think because we'd all just, you know, we just turned 18. So in the UK, you can start going to like nightclubs easier and stuff like that at that age. So the social scene was fantastic. And I think that came across on, mm. on the camera as And does well. this always happen? I mean, if we could turn our cameras, we won't. <laughs> but there was a crowd of cell phones. Following and books ready to be signed. So Does that it, always happen? It, occasionally, it happened last night. To be honest, we went to see the Arctic Monkeys in town. So I landed yesterday and went to see. We went to the show, and there was a group of guys who were like, "Can we get a photo? Yeah, fine." And then as soon as the band came on, <laughs> this side. <laughs> so we had we had a bit of both last night. Okay, identical twins. You guys ever do like a switcheroo or anything like that when you were kids? Only when the only funny enough, James only even wants to swap places when the bill comes at a restaurant. Oh, I can see so that. At a hotel, it's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. So I forgot my okay. routine, but I was is... remarking James Andrew Eric Phelps. That's your full name, it and is, then yeah. it's Oliver John Phelps. Why do you Martin have John? I've got two. Martin John. Martin. So John. we've both got two middle names, and that's because you don't. I don't even know. My mum never had a middle name. And same. She, and that's why she made up for it. She said, "You didn't even know for that." Yeah. Yeah. And that's why. Not a bad son for not yeah, that. And she said, she, 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 "She's <laughs> going to make up for it." Yeah. yeah. So she squeezed all the names in there. That's it. Yeah. Okay. In our final moments, are you guys up for a little rapid fire random questions? Like sure, yeah. quick ready? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay yeah. Ready? Favorite treat? Willow. Treat. treat. Oh, I thought it's a tree. <laughs> <laughs> Sitting, on? sitting under a willow. Interesting. That was the greatest stick, answer yeah. of all times. <laughs> He's got really good digestion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll tell you what. Yeah. <laughs> favorite treat? Um, uh, Skittles. Oh, good okay. choice. Sherbet. Okay, favorite holiday? Christmas. Spirit animal? Dog. Favorite F body part? Knee. If you mm. had to change your name? Ooh. I wouldn't. Oh, Ooh. throwing us for a curveball. Right. Okay, favorite non-curse word, one word, insult. I've just got curse words in my head now. Um, <laughs> I don't, you know, you, you, know, you can't numpty. say. The way to my heart is, fill in the blank. Talking about hedgehogs. Okay, hedgehogs. Is your bed made right now at home? Yes. yes. How do you say hello on the phone? All right. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right. All right. We're out of time. <laughs>